Here's your latest flash briefing from Western Mass News. Good afternoon, I'm Jordan Jagelinzer. Here's a look at today's headlines. Global cases of the coronavirus have reached more than 82,000, with the death total of more than 2,800. The majority of those cases remain in China. Meanwhile, in Massachusetts, state officials say there are currently 231 people being monitored and remain self-quarantined for possible exposure of the coronavirus. Since Sunday, a family of five in Pittsfield that recently traveled to China is under self-quarantine in their home. The Holyoke Police Department is issuing a public safety warning regarding bags of heroin and a new deadly substance. Police say heroin bags are being sold in Holyoke mixed with substances including fentanyl and caffeine. They also know a new substance, which is described as a synthetic cannabinoid, is also in those bags. First responders, police and ambulance crews are observing behavior consistent with PCP ingestion and some of the overdose patients they've responded to. In Chicopee, a second recreational pot shop is scheduled to open this weekend. The Massachusetts Cannabis Control Commission issued a notice authorizing Theory Wellness to begin selling adult recreational use marijuana. The store's grand opening is scheduled for 9 Saturday morning and is located on Fuller Road. Definitely a breezy day. That rain that we had earlier is out of here. Still staying breezy. The latest wind gust staying in the 40 to 50 mile per hour range of 51 mile per hour wind gusts measured in Pittsfield. We do have that wind that's going to stick around into tomorrow. Uh, even a few snow showers out in the Berkshires. Notice the Pioneer Valley. We've actually seen a little bit of sunshine as the storm system continues to lift to our north out of here. As it strengthens, as it deepens, it continues to keep those wind gusts up into tomorrow. Our future cast shows the clearing skies into tonight, into tomorrow, ushering in some of that cooler air that's going to be in place. So highs tomorrow only get Getting into the middle 30s, but wind chills will be in the 20s and even teens in many spots. Winds gusting anywhere from 20 to 30 miles per hour. Seven day forecast shows the dry weather for the most part into the next four or so days. It's Tuesday, Wednesday, and into part of Thursday that we have this nice warm up, but it's also so associated with some shower activity. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.